Welcome to this new video tutorial offered to you by LearnElectronics.org. In this video you will learn how to make a simulation tunable using sliders. Go to the graph toolbar and click on show how to annotation toolbar. Double click on the Gaussian noise generator to edit its properties. Make the standard deviation tunable, then click OK. Go to the annotation toolbar and click on the slider button. Drag and drop with your mouse in the schematic sheet to create the slider. Double click on the slider to edit its properties. First select the variable to tune, then check the option hide name prefix to hide the model designator. Finally, set the maximum value of the scale to 1 and click OK. Repeat the same steps for the sine wave generator. However, in this case the variable to tune is the frequency of the sine wave. To make the slider scale more readable, change the frequency unit of the sine wave generator from Hertz to kilohertz. Try to move the slider control bars. You will notice no change in the simulation output. This happens because you must still have to make your analysis tunable. Go to the view drop down menu and select the tune option. Afterwards, check sine wave analysis in the tune window. Now move again the slider control bars. You will see how the simulation plots change accordingly. Thank you for watching. Bookmark www.learnelectronics.org in your browser and check the website periodically for new free material. Don't forget to follow Learn Electronics on the social networks. Please support Learn Electronics with a donation, a Facebook like, a plus one on Google Plus or a tweet to your friend.